And now to Manuel High School, where the principal received a written reprimand for comments he made to students over those national anthem protests. Today, more than 100 students taking part in a sit-in to protest. And this afternoon, the principal is weighing in. Our Holden Kerwicki on the situation that is certainly not dying down just yet. Holden? Well, Rachel, 117 students received tardy slips this morning after what Manuel Principal Jerry Mays called a peaceful protest. Many of the Manuel students in attendance voiced their concerns on social media using the hashtag NotMyPrincipal. Those that I spoke with today say this is just the latest example of the boiling tensions within JCPS. A week after Principal Jerry Mays was reprimanded by JCPS leadership, Manual students turned to a peaceful protest to voice their concerns that Mays remained in power. Our biggest stand is that we support the students. You know, we're not against the staff. This isn't a, a racial war. This isn't a student staff war. We support the rights of the students, though. A few hours later, students like Fern Creek Black Student Union founder Jalen Gordon earned a seat at the table as an ad hoc committee discussed race and equality within JCPS. We talked about a lot of um, racial equity issues going on in the classroom. We're talking about the underrepresentation of, of teachers of color and school counselors of color and specifically uh, black teachers and black school counselors. University of Louisville professor Ahmad Washington says that recent incidents at Manuel and J-Town underscore that there are larger issues within the district. If we're talking about racial justice and racial equity, um, then we have to be more forthcoming in, the, in talking about the myriad ways that anti-blackness and racism persist. By standing up, or in this case sitting down, Washington says students are ensuring that their voices are being heard loud and clear. It's happening now without anyone's consent, right? So, and that's the thing about like resistance traditions, you're not asking or waiting for something to someone to allow you space to do this work, right? You're doing it because it is affirming and it is fundamentally the right thing to do. As for what comes next, Washington says it depends on how the district reacts. You might see appointees, you might see people hired, but if the actual structure, the policies and the institution doesn't transform, uh, these sorts of issues will continue to, to, uh, to reverberate and reappear in the future. This is a positive step in the right direction. I don't feel like in past years the district has taken issues like this as serious. Manual Principal Jerry Mays released a statement saying that he loves every student at Manual. He went on to add that after meeting with the Black Student Union on Friday, his focus is on how they can work together to move forward.